Hey you guys, so I wanted to talk to you guys about a little bit about postpartum and how I'm recovering and everything that's kind of going on that is a little crazy. We have a newborn, we have an 18 month old and I have a preteen, which is so crazy to say, I feel old saying that, son and life is crazy. My husband works 50 to 60 hours a week. We have two dogs. Like there is a lot going on. And I feel like with postpartum recovering with my little girl who is almost a month old, which is crazy. It is really easy to find excuses, especially when it comes to overall health and feeding my family and just taking time for us to be a family and I don't know about you guys but for me personally my favorite thing in the week is when we get to sit down together and have a meal together and we're just eating dinner home cooked food it tastes delicious I know it's good for my family and nourishing their bodies and we just talk about our day and we laugh about the silly things that Cooper says or because Elliot throws his food and I don't know but those moments to me mean the very most and I think that with my postpartum recovery with her, with my third baby, I have realized that you have to honor the feelings that make you feel good. And you can have no guilt no matter what those feelings are. So if that means spending an extra 20 minutes in the bathtub or taking a nap when you should be doing laundry or making a home cooked meal for your family, whatever it is that makes you feel like you and makes you feel good, you have to honor those feelings and do those things. So tonight I am, um, today is my laundry day. I am just folding all the laundry. We're folding all the laundry. My kids just went down from a nap and Jackson's gonna be home from work in like 40 minutes. So I really don't have that much time to prep and make dinner. That's why I am so grateful for Blue Apron. I can have dinner on the table and ready in 20 minutes and I can feel good about the goals that I have set of cooking for my family and having a sit down dinner together. Not at a restaurant, not takeout, but having more at home family dinners together. That is important to me. If this is an important thing to you and it's one of your goals, I really highly suggest Blue Apron just because it's such a convenient meal service. It comes right to your front door. You can really customize it to your family. It's healthy, fresh ingredients. So the first 50 of you guys who actually are interested in this and sign up, you guys can use the link down in my description box below and you guys are gonna get $50 off your first two weeks of Blue Apron, which is amazing. My absolute favorite thing about Blue Apron is the recipe cards that they include. Everything is broken down for you and gives you a step-by-step -step on how to prepare the meal. So it's not intimidating and you're not gonna screw it up and you're gonna nail the recipe every single time. What I love about Blue Apron is that they deliver right to your doorstep and they're farm fresh ingredients that you need in exactly the right proportions. No trips to the grocery store and no waste from un unused ingredients. They allow you to create quick and delicious chef design recipes at home. All of your meals can be prepared in 40 minutes or less and many of the recipes require only 20 to 30 minutes to complete. Blue Apron offers a large selection of recipes and as always is adding new dishes to their menu every week. You get to try new and exciting ingredients and unique recipes that maybe you didn't even know about. I have never personally eaten squash and I was a little hesitant when I started chopping it up, but when I bit into it, I was so grateful that I tried it and that Blue Apron sent it to me because I wouldn't have known about it otherwise or even thought to really use it in a recipe. Blue Apron recipes are delivered in a refrigerated box, so your ingredients will always stay fresh, even if you're not at home when your package arrives. Just like that, dinner is served, and we even had some extras for Elliot. Crazy, I even beat my husband. He's not even home yet, and I am done with dinner, and the cleanup was super minimal. A couple dishes, and we're done. Win-win for me. I'm feeling like on top of the world about this. Elliot cannot get enough of this. He loves it. Here's some couscous. Yummy, huh? Okay, the yogurt sauce on here, the yogurt sauce on here is freaking so good. And 
the recipe to make it was really simple. It's like, a, it's a healthier way to make a good sauce. I never would have thought of using yogurt, but seriously, this is probably one of my new favorite recipes. Not just saying that, but when I was cutting up the squash, I was a little worried because I'm like, mm, I don't know how this is gonna go over. I don't know how I'm gonna like this, but it's really good. Like the texture is soft and it's salty and it's just, it's delicious. This is a really, really good recipe. I wish that there was a thing as smell cam and taste cam. So I let you guys smell and taste this and then you'd want it for dinner. It's delicious. Hey YouTube, uh, I just got home from work. It is 6.30, I was late. Had a lot of work. Carly made this dinner and had it ready when I got home, which was awesome. Best wife in the world of word. Now she's feeding the baby. So she's feeding daddy and baby at the same time. Uh, and Elliot is just playing over here. Can you say hi? Hi! <laughs> I'm eating squash with beef, uh, some sort of sauce on the top, which is good, and couscous, which is also really good. And, uh, yeah, it's delicious. This whole meal is phenomenal. like it? I could eat this all the time. I don't know how you cooked the squash, but you did a really good job. It's got these cool marks, and the beef looks good. And I'm not doing any soda until 2020. Think I can do it? But I'm having water, so <laughs> this looks good. He said no. <laughs> Anyways, this is delicious. I don't know how you cooked it. Oh, you're stuck in the curtain. You want to get out? Okay, I help you. There you go. Fix your hair. Oh, good job. <laughs> okay. Anyways, hit it out of the park with this. I wish I could have been here to help you cook it because you had... <laughs> I feel bad every time. Like, I know I, I can go to work, but if I ever have to stay late at work, I feel bad because I'm like, oh, she's been at home all day working with two kids. One of our kids has tons and tons of energy. He's a lot of fun. How about you? Oh, you gotta sit by me? Okay, I give, okay, don't use your hand. You gotta use a fork. Okay, let's use forks. Oh, tooted! <laughs> oh, you want the straw. Okay, I had to take it away from you because I had to film. You like the straw? Oh, you wanna put it in the water and have a drink? Okay. Is that for Sherry? Mmm, say yummy. Okay, anyways, I'm gonna eat this food, it was delicious.